was his name? He was saying, he was like, for people reference, you can't have that much time to see, or they'll charge you. And I was like, I was like, no, you can't. All of them had to get less hair. I have a feeling that uh, this isn't over. Which is annoying, but whatever. The dogs, they should. You still rented us the car, so. It's so, only I, in the back. If I, we had time to lint roll it ourselves, I would have, but. But the thing is, legally, we don't have to. No, I know, but. And that's what I told the girl there, because what she made me sign the thing with bring to the thing thing. I said, just so you know, like, you have dogs, so it's going to be fair. We're not obligated to pay your cleaning fee for the ADA law. And I have, I, pull, I, I have it pulled up on my phone, so they give me shit for it. Yeah, I know, we found it on the ADA. So they can't charge me. We're at the rental car, please drop mm -hmm. in your car. You take it for me when you box. I hate that car. I know. I, stupid I, car. I hate that car. But, Oh, wait, wait. I'm heading to the airport yeah. soon. Oh, it's right here. 
Oh, uh, we're gonna run and see if they can go potty with us, okay? Sorry. It's just right here, okay. Huh. Okay. Oh, there's a bench. Okay, well, it really doesn't help that it looks and smells like a bench on this, so. I said that it was sitting like the last one. That's a great thing. Hey, go buddy! Not much to go, but. What is that for? Put your dog on? <laughs> Good girl, Red. Good job. So, the car rental service is trying to charge us $150 because of the dog hair left behind in the car. In the trunk. In the trunk of the car, because that's where we store the dogs when we were driving. Uh, that's illegal and stupid. And they've been dickheads from the start. It was a pain in the ass getting our car and it was a pain in the ass dropping it off. And we explained it when we dropped it off because the guy was like, oh, they're gonna charge you extra for that. And I was like, mm -hmm, you can't, service animal. You can only charge a fee if there's damage done. You can't charge extra cleaning fees. You can't do that at hotels, you can't do that anywhere. So, yeah, so Amanda's dealing with them right now because they're like, oh, you can't call our manager. You have to email him, which is me stupid. And it's gonna take forever to do the process because they, they charge us today and I'm like, no, we're not paying that. So stay tuned for an update on that because it's really stupid. We have to try and get both because right now, but we're flying United, so. We're a little nervous that they're not going to give us a book up. I was told that I'm sorry? Uh, yeah, on the way here, we, we flew bullpen. And someone over the phone told me that, that we would be upgraded at the gate. Um, how much? I don't know, on the way here... Yeah, on the way here, we just we just came up here and said that, that we needed early boarding, and then they, they moved us to a seat that was easier for us to get to. It's just as a courtesy, but if you're traveling with an animal, you know better, you need to... You know, it's service, service They're service animals. animals. Okay. Okay, it's just... Other handlers do this all the time. Hey, yeah, they just they just told me they told me to come up here. That's the yeah. They, they weren't available at the time. Yeah, and on the flight here, they also weren't available, but they moved us to them. Also have one other with us. Say, and then leave. Leave. Thank you. Sorry, I don't know why I just completed that conversation. No, you're fine. No, it doesn't matter. But I mean, at least we can. 
I mean, like, right now you have three seats together. So yeah. I've got seats where I can give you a seat next. Well, the seat next to it would be open. Uh-huh. Nothing available in the box. But it, it, I think this would work better for you. Come show you. See, right now you guys have 37 DEFs here. Yeah. But I've got like 23D with nobody next to you. 23D, they're on the aisle with nobody uh -huh. in the middle. So, so it's like Sarah would sit across. So you have three aisles. You won't be together, but you'll be close to each other. Got it. Um, do you want me to ask Sarah? Like two across and one. Right got it. It's up to you, because otherwise we're going to have to, because my just thing is that they have to like squish under the seat and like, I have really bad hips, so just like walking is going to be really hard. Like, yeah. 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 Like, yeah
awful about upgrading the bulkhead, but I'm glad that they were able to at least do this because there's no way all three of us would have fit. Rudy's a good girl. <laughs> She's in her donut. She donutted. She has all this space and she still wants to donut. <laughs> oh, poor Doxy. <laughs> All right, so our first flight is two hours and we land in DC and then we have a four hour flight back home, five hour flight back home. Amanda earlier today and I came in. It felt like a radar clock was still on. Go party. Oh, this is a big area. 
We're in DC right now. We're gonna be in Cali in six, six hours. hours. Yay! So we're being deplaned because there's a technical issue. We've been sitting here for like two hours. Yeah, two it's hours. been two hours. So yeah, we're being deplaned, and who knows when we're gonna get another flight. Super cool. Um, been perfect though, they're just laying there <laughs> sleeping, so. <laughs> I'm glad they're enjoying their time. We got deplaned, and they're sending us to a different gate. Yay. Amanda, how are you doing? I'm tired. Yeah, Sarah had a breakdown. It's fine. It was, it was just a mini breakdown. It was just a, it was just a little moment, it's all right. Out looking for chocolate because I'm craving chocolate. Um, everything sucks and we're dying. Uh, apparently, there was another dog on our plane the whole time. Nobody noticed. Um, we pre boarded, so I'm thinking it just got to the gate after we did, and then it was in one of the rows close to the front of the plane because we never saw them. All the restaurants and like shops are closed, though, so I don't think I'm gonna be able to find any candy, which is sad. Um, okay, yeah, everything's closed. Cool. It's only 7.50 or something. 7.50, oh, 8, okay. Apparently everything closes, so that's cool. Good to know. Um, awesome. Okay, well, I'm headed back. Brady's being a trooper. Oh, baby, I know you're tired. Come on. We were on the plane for like two hours before they declined us, but we could just slept the whole time. Like the legend she is. So. She's been a good girl, huh, baby? You good girl. Yeah, you're so good. You're so good. Ooh, you're, such, you're such a good girl, man. You're a good leave it. Good girl. You're a good leave it. That's just my baby dog. That's just my baby dog. That's just my... Hello? That's just my baby dog. <laughs> Boy, you're so cute. Hello? Hey, girl. It's so cute. Alright, follow. Follow? Ridley, follow. Thank you. Follow next song. Tired. 
Ridley. Like, like I thought we were going to slow, but then I turned around and they were not there. Leave it. Good girl. Good girl. Oh god, oh god. 